Hello everybody, my name is John Flynn, and welcome to... Right now we have game releases, and there are a lot of games coming out this week. So first up is Naruto Shibuden Ninja Storm Ultimate Revolution for the PS3, 360, and PC. Also on September 16th, we have Fairy Fencer F for the PS3, Arc Age for the PC, Theat Rhythm Final Fantasy Curtain Call for the 3DS, and Cooking Mama 5 Bon Appetit for the 3DS as well. On September 17th, Flockers comes out for the PC and Xbox One. Last, we have Tropico 5 being ported to the Mac and Linux, and Wasteland 2 coming to PC, Mac, and Linux, all on September 19th. This next segment is our review. So, if you've been living under a rock for the past week, you might be unaware that Destiny, Bungie's newest IP, was just released. It started off with some rocky reviews early on in the week, but leveled out near the end. Metacritic right now has it as a 76 out of 100. I've taken the liberty to ask a few students what they thought about it. So let's go to John out in the field. Now, we see that Destiny has fallen victim to the hype train. It's not the greatest game of all time, but it's not terrible either. It has its ups, and it has its downs. So if you've been thinking about buying it, go ahead, do it. Get some friends to buy it too. Just have fun with it. It's the closest you'll ever come to having Peter Dinklage be your best friend anyways. The Hive haven't been on Earth in centuries. That wizard came from the moon. Last we have news. Now some big news today, we have Microsoft buys Mojang for $2.5 million. Is this for the better or the worse? Only time will tell. The GTA 5 trailer comes out revealing the release date of November 18th for both the PS4 and Xbox One version. The PC, however, won't come out till July 27th of next year. The next-gen versions will come with new weapons, vehicles, and activities, on top of all the graphical enhancements. Something else we've all been waiting for, Watch Dogs will be coming to the Wii U November 18th, so that one guy who owns a Wii U but doesn't have Watch Dogs will finally get it. 
Good for you. Some sad news now. Middle Earth Shadow of Mordor for the PS3 and 360 has been delayed, but this will not affect the PS4 or Xbox One version. In international news, the Xbox One hits Japan, with the impact being, well, just sad. Only 23,562 units were sold in the first week. I guess the Sony fandom is just way too strong there. Also, Super Smash Bros. 3DS's demo comes out this Friday. That's right, September 19th, this Friday. Finally, Battlefield 4's last DLC will be coming out, Final Stand. It's more on the futuristic side, closer to Battlefield 2142, with hover tanks and rail guns. It's coming out sometime late this summer, so it should be pretty soon. That's all for today's show. Don't forget to leave a like if you enjoy the show, and subscribe to the Psychron Media Network. See you next time.